fighting out of the white corner, Nicholas Rooney from Sheffield, England. Ooh. Yeah, I mean, that was the team I used to use in uh, Champman. <laughs> FIFA, create That's your own team. Big, big fan United. of Sheffield, Sheffield sorry, United. Sorry. <laughs> I got to go tell him. 195 centimeters tall, Aaron. I believe this is the tallest fighter we've ever had in the high fight rank. 77 kilograms is the weight. His record, 39 fights, 30 wins, 9 losses. We've been fighting in Thailand for around 6 years now. And now I believe he's in Uvon Ratchapani. But domestically on the local scene, so this is a real step up in competition. He's fighting that man right there, Pengnun Sik Chai Sarong. Originally from Nakhon Sawan province here in Thailand, he is 118 centimeters tall, so giving away 15 centimeters. Yeah, I mean, we saw him fight uh, Nicholas Mendez before, and we and thought he, that was like a yeah. challenge, 190 centimeters, but Rooney coming in at like 195. You, I like the way you brought up Nicholas Mendez, because that's who the winner of this will fight in the final of the 73.5 kilogram competition. Peng Nung's record stands at 103 fights, 85 victories with 14 losses and four draws. He's a former King's Cup champion. He's also a former Indian Cup fight champion here at Five Fight. Wow, that is a high Incredible. Sad that the camera was used with a high shot. Yeah, I mean, he could throw that, like, that downward spiking elbow without even jumping. True. Then he can walk under his legs. Then he can sit Jai Saron in the black corner, representing Thailand. Nicholas Rooney in the white shorts in the white corner, representing Sheffield, England. The second semi-final of the 73.5 kilograms. Middleweight King's Cup tournament where all fighters got to weigh in at 77. Yes, of course, of course. I didn't think you'd have to explain that. Okay, boys and girls, round one. You might see Deng Neng throw the tiger uppercut. He's gonna have to get a step ladder to throw a hook. How many tall jokes can we do in a minute? Reminds me of Undertaker vs. Giant Gonzalez in WrestleMania 9. There's about four people listening to our YouTube freaking out right now. <laughs> oh my goodness, this is so tall. When Rudy tells a story, do they call it a tall tale? Oh, well, they should now. Like, they're moving in, right hand, over the top. Oh, and left hand, left kicks. Chopping down the tree to the body. Just keep your eyes on anything that comes from the left side of the Peng Neng's body, left hand, left kicks. Peng Neng's currently ranked number one in the world by the World Boy Thai Organization. I'd like heavyweight. He's throwing body kicks to the thigh right now. Riddle, you've got to try and... You've got to keep away from Nick, because if you move backwards, Nick can throw a, kick, a body kick that's going to hit him in the head. That is... That's an unbelievable crack of that. It yeah, really is amazing. amazing. Oh, beautiful right hands here from Tengnun. Oh, right oh, my hand! Goodness. To be honest, I gotta give Rooney credit. He's tough. He's, he's taken a lot more of those left hands than, than a lot of people do. I was gonna say than I have. Don't get ahead of yourself. It's almost like shades of uh, Game of Death with Bruce Lee and Kareem Abdul-Jabbar. <laughs> That's great. What about the mountain? Right the guy oh my goodness, <laughs> Game of Thrones reference. Who am I working with? Body shot from Tang Nung. Again, going for that low kick. Oh, Ooh, another shocking left. You know, so often in these fights, Aaron, we see Tang Nang connects with that first left hand. You see the other fighter just like take a deep breath and say, oh my god, like what have I gotten myself into? But, but Rooney really has taken them well. Yeah. Really impressed. Taking a breather. Woo. He's not going to get a head kick unless he's jumped about Van Damme, right? It's not as easy to punch up and generate as much power. Rooney there trying to shoot some body kicks. Oh, beautiful uppercut. Left and right hand and an elbow to connect. Wow, 
Wow, Rudy is tough. Tough as one. nails. Survives wow. round one. Get to the steal right there. Look at that, he threw an elbow there, Aaron, and it just like grazed his chest. We know that Feng Lung is now training out of best actually. We have a good defensive conditioning team over there, and he looks fantastic. Probably don't have any fighters up here tonight. Jimmy's got Matt Lucas on the top of Steamer Pet. Still wouldn't be hot tall enough, right? <laughs> Round two. Let's see if Deng Moon does any more kicks up his sleeve. There's quite a bit of redness and bruising on the neck of Rooney, because that's where a lot of Deng Neng's punches are landing. Might be the first time I've seen that. Looks like he just survived a, a heavy night of dating. Oh, good left hand. hand Deng Neng. Good combination there from Tech. Now moving in and out. Probably a good tactic. Yeah, Rooney coming for that. Only... Counter left, just swinging it air. Yeah, I was going to say the only danger is when you're moving out is that Rooney can throw a high kick. But he's got to put more whip on those kicks and he's going to double Tech and move out the way quite easily. Yeah, I think Tech is going to see them coming. Combinations and finishes with a body shot to Deng Moon and a low kick. Outside five to Deng Moon. And again, trying to chop down that tree. Oh! oh! Beautiful left hand there from the tie. Down goes Rooney. But Deng Moon needs to break it. Look at that. I mean, I cannot believe how quickly he just got up as well. That was a murderous shot. From Deng Deng. That ends fights. And Rooney got right back to his feet. You know what's going to come now? He's going to look for that left hand once again. He's setting it up with those low kicks out of oh. it. He's working a tree. Deng Deng getting for the kill. Watch again. Watch, watch him go for the low kick. The hands go down and then the left hand comes in. Low kick. Oh, good block that time, though. I think, I think Deng Deng's going to need the ref to step in and wave this off because I don't think Rooney is going to go down and stay down. It's going to have to be one of those situations where the ref just says, okay, this is too one-sided, Rooney's taking too much punishment. I don't think we're going to get that. I've seen enough. I mean, I just feel like that's the only chance. You underestimate Feng <laughs> oh, oh! Oh! Timba! No, mouthpiece comes out. I was wrong! <laughs> My goodness, though, that, that man is tough as nails. As is the winner, Feng who now will go on to face Nicolas Mendes in a rematch that we saw last year. Oh, look at that look of agony. Oh. That is... Yeah, it's sad to see that, actually. That was so good. It took a lot of punishment. He didn't want to go down. Maybe he's pride hurt more than his face. Or maybe it's a leg issue. It's the hardest I've, I've ever seen Teng Neng work for a knockout. I'll give you that, I agree. But Teng Neng does it again, the destroyer of men. Oh. He really looks like he's in pain. I wonder if it's something, yeah, like you said, a leg issue or something more serious. Let's have a look at the uh, destruction imposed upon Nick Rooney by Deng Nung here, went for the legs, the arms dropped, oh, oh, and then he found a home for the left hand. And again, I think we're going to need a stretcher. Yeah, the stretcher's in here for Nick Rooney. Well, I'm almost glad that I, I didn't do my thing. Oh, there you go. I think that's where the grimace was. Hurt his knee? Yeah, around the knee area, or right below knee. on the car. 
seen how dangerous they can be in the UFC. I never enjoy doing my there, medics. There, there, that one. Bang. And they can see that he's hurt now. Of course, showed no mercy, moved in to finish the fight off. ดูเดือดมั้ยแล้วนี่คือการกัดฟันสู้ของจริงครับคุณแดนนี่ฮะโอ้โหยืนได้ขนาดนี้นี่ต้องถือว่าต้องชื่นชมนะครับโอ้โ